What's up, y'all? Beyond the Harmony, beyondtheharmony.com, and I am Cecil motherfucking West, back with the one and only John fucking Lippy. And it's time for the question of the day. I got a really good question today, John. Like, I, I think you're going to dig this because this is really going to let you me and all the listeners really open up their imagination with all the fucking features we have heard. I mean, we are talking bone has collaborated with the best of the motherfucking best. And we know that including easy Pac, and big, big pun. So many of them, so many of them, but with everyone that bone has collaborated with, who would you like to see Bone do a feature with that they haven't done yet? Ooh, man. Well, man, it, it, it's like eras. You know, it's changed over time. I think in present day, present day, because, you know, in the past it might have been different. But present, I think of Imagine Dragons because they, they seem to have, like, the hottest production and the hottest team right now backing them. If Imagine Dragons did an album with Bone, I think that would blow the planet up. I think that would be if, – if Bone needed to have another comeback, if they could somehow connect with Imagine Dragons, that would be some killer other world level stuff. I'd also like to see them – so that's my number one. But Daft Punk, like you've seen what Daft Punk did with The Weeknd with Starboy. That was flaming. Um, and when I think of collabos, like when Busy did that song with Johnny Craig, Bottled Up Like Smoke – that blew me away from the Crossroads 2010 album. I was like, man, I hope the whole Crossroads 2010 is like this. So I would love like a whole album like like bottled up like smoke. I like with Lincoln Park, you know, now that Chester's gone, you know, imagine Busy taking over for Chester because Lincoln did that album with Jay-Z and, and that was epic. Um, obviously, I think everybody wants a Dr. Dre bone. We've been wanting that for like 20 years. You see the pictures of Busy with uh, Steve LaBelle and Dr. Dre and you're like, Man, I, I hope they recorded something. Um, back when Michael <laughs> Jackson and Prince were alive, I was like, bro, because like Bones made songs that 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 based off of Prince. Like you got Busy did uh, When Thugs Cry, and then Crazy did Can't Get Out the Game, which also kind of sampled Thugs Cry uh, verbally. Um, and then Michael Jackson, they did um, uh, uh, What's Wrong with This World. They did something. They they don't care about us. They did they don't care about us on. Thug World Order, but then they they did one that was based on the Earth song, and so um, I think Michael Jackson and Prince obviously that can't happen at this point. I would like to see a Dr. Dre produced Michael Jackson album as well, but I'm going with oh oh wait hold up I still got one actually more than Imagine Dragons for my own self I would want an album between Bone and TQ and Mariah Carey like that's the group to do a whole album together. And possibly have Drake and Nelly featured on it, and Tech Nine. I know that's a lot. Like I know you, you want just you want just one. My favorite couples are with TQ. I think to bring Bone on the map in present day Imagine Dragons, but but ultimately my favorites are with Mariah and TQ. But that's already been done. Imagine Dragons hasn't. So I'm I'm gonna go with Imagine Dragons. I know I said a lot there. That's I got a big wish list, you know what I'm saying? Like these are ones that haven't happened. Tech Nine needs to happen at some point, like officially, not just like the Midwest Choppers, but 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 Tech and Busy, everybody wants that. But I'll go with the yeah. Dragons. You me. you know that uh, <clears throat> Tech Nine released an acapella called Speed of Sound, and he said that it was for a Bone Thugs feature that that never got finished. I wish I wish somebody from Bone was on Worldwide Choppers, and I wish there was a real music video for Worldwide Choppers. Like that was the jam that that should have had Bone on it. Well, John, John came up with a pretty big feature list. Uh, I built Bone up at the beginning of this to have such a big feature feature list, and boy, John was able to come up with a list. Uh, I, I don't know if mine is as fancy, but but you gave a back in the day, and then you gave a current. Uh, so so I think that um that that I'll do that as well. So for back in the day, as as sacrilegious as I think people would have thought this this is, I would have loved to have heard Bone and and Wu Tang together in a big posse oh. cut. 
and and, and wow. not because I'm a huge Wu Tang fan uh, per se. I'm I'm not not a Wu Tang fan. I like Wu Tang. I've seen Wu Tang live, um, <clears throat> you know, a bunch of times. So I'm a, I'm a fan, but obviously not the way I'm a Bone fan. But the reason why I would have loved to have heard a, you know. A, uh, a big posse track and 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 that's a huge song i mean you know you got nine members of wu-tang ten if you count capadonna um and then five members of bone so i mean we're talking 15 fucking people but these two crews mean so much to hip-hop um and and they're so unique you know the 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 foundations of Bone and Wu Tang and all the members and just just how amazing the two groups are. Um, it, it would have been crazy to to just hear Old Dirty Bastard and Busy Bone on a track together, or oh man, you know Rizza Rizza and Crazy Bone, you know going back and forth, or you know who whoever. You know, you God and Crazy Bone, uh, fucking Raekwon. You know, so, so just, I think that would have just been a really cool, cool feature, even if it wasn't the whole Wu Tang Clan. So that would have been my back in the day. My my current that I would like to hear, I would either like to hear, and 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 you guys are gonna have to remember, John doesn't listen to a lot of current hip hop, so this some of these may not mean shit to John. Um, I would either like to hear Bone. With Ritz from Strange Music, which I, I think you know Ritz. Um, I know Ritz. Ritz, Ritz double times. He, he's got cool harmony. Uh, he comes up with really great hooks. Uh, I just think that he would have fun on a song with Bone. I, I don't think just because they both rap fast that they're necessarily the, the same, and I'm not picking it because he's a fast rapper. It's actually because I think the guy has some really cool harmonies and some really cool choruses. And I think that him and Bone would make a cool song. Or I'd love to hear Bone, and this is a weird one, I'd love to hear Bone and Kevin Gates. I think Kevin Gates and Bone would make a cool song because Kevin Gates is somebody else that likes to, to fuck with some harmonies. And I think Kevin Gates and Busy Bone would have a, uh, a great time together in the studio. So, um, and, and just as an honorable mention, because you had said it earlier, and I, I just thought it was great. I think Bone and The Weeknd would probably make a really cool song together as well. Um, so I also gave you guys the plethora with the Wu-Tang Clan and Ritz and The Weeknd. <laughs> and fucking uh, John gave you the Imagine Dragons, Dr. Dre, Daft Punk. Fucking we gave you the big list. Uh, I hope you guys have a huge list for us as well. If you do, make sure you leave it in the comments below. Don't forget to share this with another Bone fan so they can tell you their big list. And we'll catch you guys on the next.